in nearly five months and still no sign of 85 year old Lucy Buchanan who disappeared from her North Nashville home. The mother and grandmother was suffering from early stages of dementia. News Channel 5's Erin Cantrell joins us this morning and Erin, I know you spoke with the lead detective on this case and found out she has family here in Tennessee, so she may have traveled there. Yeah, Amy, potentially in Fayetteville and authorities, they have been notified that she could potentially be in the area. But Detective Chandler says with these cases, you kind of have to assume any and everything is possible because she does have Alzheimer's, so she could be un operating under the fact that it's 20 years ago. Now, even though she's retired, she could think she lives and works somewhere else, or she may have a friend that passed away years ago that she's trying to locate. And what makes this case so unique is the fact is that in five months, besides surveillance video from the day she went missing on November 24th, there have been no other confirmed sightings. Now, videos show her leaving her apartment and walking down Buena Vista Pike and then southbound on Clarksville Pike. Now, the, la the last video surveillance they have of her is traveling by the Walgreens there on Clarksville Pike, and police have followed a lot of leads based on tips and her past actions. And Detective Chandler also put together a team to search the property and areas nearby on foot, also utilizing technology and drones to try to locate Miss Lucy. And he says her family has been instrumental in helping locate her, and he wants the public to keep an eye out because her family greatly misses her, and they're just worried sick. We would like people to pay attention to the videos that we already have to show the clothing that she has. She also had a flip style cell phone and she had her keys on a lanyard. If there's a chance that she stumbled onto someone's property and maybe have dropped an item or anything like that, that could help us give an indication of the direction she went after we have her own video. And you heard Detective Chandler there mention her phone, and they say that they did trace it for a while, but then the phone died, so that was another dead end. And Lucy's family, they tell us they went to her apartment, and everything looks normal, like no one's touched anything. So they're just very concerned. So if you have any information about Lucy's whereabouts, you're asked to call police, and no detail is too small.